Hi traders, this is Andrew Masters from FIBO Group and welcome to my weekly Forex report. To kick off the week on Monday, we expect a slow start due to a lack of statistics to hit the market, but there may be some trading opportunities and volatility in the euro on the back of a speech by ECB President Mario Draghi. On Tuesday during the Asian session, the market will await the NAB Business Conditions Index from Australia, which is a clear indicator of business confidence and should present some opportunities in the Australian dollar. In the European session, we'll see the Zoo Economic Survey sediment as well as CPI figures from Germany. The market is expecting a yearly figure of 2.2% for the CPI numbers, which shows the economy is on the road to recovery and deflation may be a thing of the past, and we expect the euro to benefit on this news. On Wednesday, during the Asian session, we'll see industrial production figures from Japan, which came at a disappointing 0.8% last month, and another poor number may put pressure on the Japanese yen. The highlight of the day will be during the American session, with the release of retail sales figures, as well as an interest rate decision from the US Federal Reserve. The market is now priced in, 100% chance of a rate hike, but some say it's not a done deal, so this release will be closely monitored and we expect extreme volatility in the US dollar. On Thursday during the Asian session, we'll see the latest unemployment rate and job participation figures from Australia, which will be closely monitored by investors, and volatility in the Australian dollar is expected. In the European session, we'll see an interest rate decision from the Bank of England, followed by a monetary press conference. Although no changes in rates are expected, the following statement will be closely monitored for signs of the bank's future movements, and we expect volatility and trading opportunities in the British pound. To finish off the week on Friday, the focus will be on the American session, with the release of industrial production figures from the US. Analysts are predicting a number of 0.2%, well as well up on last month's figures of minus 0.3%, and if they are right, we should see the US dollar finish the week on a strong note. That's all from me at FIBO Group, and I'll see you all next week.